we got Cheek and Roy pulling up for this game one. We are so excited this ever taking us right back to PS2. Get this to make it out of pools. Let's get right into it. Uh, yep, that landing up here. Not quite able to get the full juggle off of it. And he's doing such a great job of just kind of, you know, playing in such uh, in these uh, in these spacings where you can just immediately react to whatever Web does and just swing with a swing with a sledgehammer when uh, Web JP's swing around dual wielded uh, pillows. <laughs> There we go. We're going to see some big sheet damage coming out. Already nice up oh. air into Nair again. Nice. We're seeing some corner combos being thrown yeah. out. The patented uh, WebJP, you know, IGJ um, platform extensions we see. And evening it up. I actually like how he incorporated a side switch on there. The is, parry on the needles? Kusi, you're crazy. Uh, uh, that's why I said this guy. This guy's like, oh, what frame is this? Or like, uh, how does this interaction go? I don't know. But like, what he does know is he knows how to mess you up. Yeah, definitely. He's definitely awake going into this game one. Gives some decent damage on Webb already. Ooh. Looking for that Dancing Blade, but Webb finding his way out of there, because that definitely could have spelled Raps. Yeah. Trying to find some damage of his own here, 106% on this Roy. Great jab. Next to that jab again. Him. All right, Tech Girl's in. Good awareness, knowing that there's not a lot of WebGP can do, but barely gets to those needles, and that back air actually taking it. Very good stuff using that back air. Webb able to close that stock Oh, that's out. huge. Not quite, uh, just goes for the down tilt. I wonder if he could have gotten a uh, sweet spot in there on that parry, or if you know he would have pancaked under it into his tower. Ooh, then All right, he knows his ledge intangibility. Web playing attack. so well right here at the ledge, finding that dash tag again. Ooh, sticking to the ledge there, looking for a crazy read on the rollout. Not able to find that just yet. Now Kusi in the driver's seat, not able to find that on the ledge. Right. Still opting for that back air, getting fucking to the other side of the stage. So he pulls it out here and oh, find he that. wanted that ledge trump, but WebGP was ready. And that was fast, too. Yep, there's that forward tilt. We actually had Sky coaching him a little bit, saying to uh, a little bit earlier, saying just go for the uh, the forward air in that scenario. Oh, but no. ultimate, what, the the phenomenally designed game as it is, you just sometimes that, that the air dodge, it's like uh, a bad habit. It just comes out when you least expect it. That's so unfortunate, but now. Kuzi down against the Sheik. Web trying right. to jump his way back on, get Does have damage. the ledge trap, unlocked though. Finally finds his way out of there. Kuzi not quite faced from that unfortunate SD. But, right. Oh my gosh. Web JP's, you know, advantage is such a sight to behold, you know. Oh yeah, definitely. I mean, Web's coming out of the corner of that dash tech once again, keeping Kusi here on the ropes, looking for that forward air out of shield once again. Needles in hand, looking for that pressure. Nice snare once again. Kusi trying to find that opening with the down air. Yeah. Gets Web immediately out of there with that back air, putting him back on the ledge. All right, rolls past. First roll of the game coming out from Web. He hasn't quite been picking that option. Nice grab. Just picks it out. Tries to threaten the two frame with that down air, but Web did start the upbeat from above ledge. Ooh. And he was bouncing fish. The best in the business to, to hit that confirm. Very good stuff to Webb coming out in that needle of Bouncing Fish, closing a two stock out in game number one against Kusi. Mm -hmm. But man, that very good play so far on the set. Both of these players playing super well. I mean, Webb keeping up that, that decent pressure coming out from ledge. Kusi finding like an instinctual play, looking for those reads, but not able to, to uh, capitalize as often as he should be. Yeah, and th and that's where you know it, it starts going is that like once he gets in those you know, those opportunities, he, he's not getting enough of a buffer. And Webb's doing such a great job at scaring out the you know, uh, the defensive plays that Kuzi quite you know quite can't um, close it out. Ooh, nice use of that bouncing fish there, 58 percent. Actually, beat out the floor here. Air coming out, Kusi trying to keep this pressure away. Yeah. Kusi has that bad habit of jumping off the ledge and he's getting consistently punished for it. Yeah, he just kept jumping out of the corner and, you know, even though there is that, that huge pot of gold with the advantage you get from that, that jump off the ledge, you know, there is that, that double-edged sword. All right, great anti-air jab. Not quite getting the full, uh, full combo hit. All right, WebJP just walks up to him. Now throw the back air coming out. Jumping, oh, into the needles. Webb going absolutely crazy right now. Into and the bouncing the fish. Golly. And 28% only on this first stock. 
And this is like, this is Royville. This is, this is the stage where like, you're like, oh gosh, Roy took me here. <laughs> and nah, Webb is just looking completely unbothered by this instead. Taking it by the reins. Backdowns. Up three stocks to one. Kusi just looking absolutely befuddled. Needles coming out again. Nice air dodge to ledge. All right, double nair. Ooh, Nile will punish that bouncing fish there, unfortunately. Ah, uh, he won that, that near jab bear. Not quite, though. Oh. Good parry coming out from, uh, from Kusi, but he's quite down. Ooh, nice. That jab bear actually doesn't even take it. Web making his way back, getting back onto ledge. Rolling, looking for the needles, and I will give him a big punish. Back to coming out from Web once again. Look Wait that on that double jump, but the sour spot. Roy's kryptonite is, you know, random sour spots at these big percents. Well, back here immediately coming out of shape. Webb looking for a punish here. Still sitting at three socks, sitting very comfortably. Kusi just struggling to close this out. Literally anything to get back into this game, but Webb is just looks, sitting so comfy. Needles again into back air. It's looking like wraps at this point. Right. Nice high recovery. There we go. Good punish there. Pokes him, pokes him out, but again, just not a killing blow, and that's what you need right here. But what is going to be a killing blow? That down tilt up air, and wow, Webb just. Like, he. Kusi was doing so well that first game, so I'm glad, like, oh, you know, the this, this smaller stage, you know, it's going to be a little bit more close quarters. But, um, with what we saw.